They say that the best camera is the one you already have with you. But what about a light meter? Can an app actually do the same thing that a real light meter does? Let's take a look at the app Pocket Light Meter. So this app is real easy to use. All you have to do is just tap on the screen wherever you want and the camera will adjust accordingly along with the settings at the bottom. At the bottom you also have a few buttons like hold which will freeze frame your shot. You have the button to go back and forth from front camera to back camera and you also have your log button too. You just tap that and you'll be able to type a few notes. At the bottom you have your settings for shutter speed, f-stop and ISO. Two of the three can be locked at the same time. All you have to do to unlock them is just tap once and then twice and then the pop-up menu will come up and you can switch the settings to whatever you want. In the settings you have the option to switch to turn sounds on and off, to switch interfaces and to also show additional data. For interface you can tweak between wheels or the old school one that I was using. The wheels one looks like this. It looks a little different. It looks a little too, I don't know. I just like the look of the old one. Below that for exposure settings, you can tweak the exposure correction and also switch uh, the shutter aperture and ISO to full halves and thirds of a stop. And below that, you also have the option to turn on the focus point, turn it off. You can also do the same thing with the log button. And it also gives you the option to log into Dropbox. The app is available for both iOS and Android, 99 cents on Android, it's free on iOS, but it comes with ads, and if you want to get rid of them, you just pay 99 cents. And there is a secondary option where if you want to buy the developer a pint, you can pay $5, so if you're feeling a little generous, then yes, go ahead and do that. Okay, so this is all fine and dandy, but how does it compare to an actual light meter? Well, a friend of mine brought hers over and we tested them side by side, and the difference in, in readings, well... They were just half a stop to a third of a stop apart, so that was pretty good. I was very surprised at how accurate it was compared to the real light meter. So if you're looking for just a secondary meter, if you, if you have an actual light meter, but you want a second one, or if you can't afford a light meter and you want, you know, an alternative, I really recommend getting this because it's, well, it's worth it. I've used it and I still do, so yeah, get this app. So thanks for watching and check out my other overviews and reviews.